three, two, one. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? This is Miss Jenkins, and I'm here with my little sis, Moni Phone. She's going to drop her Instagram information and all that good stuff for y'all in the bottom bar. If you're interested, y'all know what to do. Just follow. But do it later. Just follow. Just follow. It's okay. Um, follow, 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 follow the so, light-skinned girl. Oh. So, <laughs> so when we learn like how you come with the gossip. You When you come through, you come with the gossip. With and the I know you. What you. What, what, what Gatorade, is. liquor. All the liquid shade breeze. Okay. So we have to give a shout out to Janelle Monet. Oh yes, Janelle Monet is doing her thing right now. Sandra Bland's mother, Chicago Bean, um, Black Lives Matter, and they do. Um, all lives matter, but uh, I don't want to be racist. But Black Lives Matter a little bit more right now. But anyway, Black Lives um, Matter all day, every day, because we know all lives matter. Black people are the only one getting left out of the living being situation. Right. Right. So, fuck all that. I can't stand First of all, can we just pause for the cause real quick? Because I just want to say how annoying it is, like, when I'm online. Mm-hmm. And, you know, I be doing my activist thing. Right. But, for the most part, I just speak my mind. And people, you know, cannot wait. People not of color. Right. Can't wait to be like, well, all lives matter. All lives matter. Don't you know? All lives matter. And all lives, they they do matter. But all lives are not being shot down in the street or um, seriously again. killed in jail cells or in police custody. Well. Um, you know, all, that's not happening to all lives. All yes. all children of other races or colors or whatever are not being shot down with no guns or anything like that. You know, they're they're not being shot down. So all all lives do matter, but right now we need to understand that black lives matter all as well cuz we shouldn't have to say also black lives matter too. Right. That right. that doesn't make any sense. I should not right. have to be afraid. I I've, I've already had my rant with this. So right. I'm telling so, you. So in other news, um, but shout out to Janelle Monet. Shout out to Janelle Monet. She's doing not a lot thing. of people doing it. If I, I'm, I have to say, Jay Z and Beyonce, they bailed out. They did like an eighty thousand dollars, or they bailed out like eighty people or something, something like that. And like, I was like, oh, how convenient that you did that right before you launched title and charged niggas up the ass for twenty dollars for that damn. Feeling myself video that ain't nobody still seen. I saw Jay Z. Oh, was it good? You didn't see it? No. Where is it? Get your life. Get, get. If it ain't on YouTube, I'm not doing it. I'm not paying It's y'all. on YouTube. No, it's that's, not. That, it is on YouTube, and that's the biggest argument with titles and customers who are not going for title is because of the simple fact that you want us to pay monthly for something that will be on YouTube once it's released, or will be there will be links out once it's released. So why would I continuously give my money for something that eventually this is going to be free? Yeah. So I'll wait. Right. Basically, in a nutshell, I'll wait. I, I will wait. Um, pause the game real quick. What's Today's going? news. Um, poor Erica Mina and Erica Mina. Oh. And Shad Shad Moss Bow Wow, whatever you spoke your boat. Uh-huh. Um. Trouble in Paradise or not? Like, um, Bow Wow, I guess, po- posted via Instagram a picture basically stating that he is going to go back to the old him. Now, caption, not that bad. Picture, bad. Picture, him laying there. Ten, seven, seven, ten women around him laid up just like a hoe. You know, just chilling in the cut. And then the caption kills the game because yeah. it's, I want to go back to the old me. And that would hurt somebody. So, um, I hope they get it together because I really do like them together. And I think that he's been keeping Erica Min on her toes. I haven't heard any ratchet news about her lately. Except for this. Be- except for this. And this is not that ratchet because Trouble in Paradise, it does happen. And when you're a celebrity, people catch any little thing that can happen in your relationship. So, I really do wish them the best. B to the U to the T, though. But, uh-huh. Erica Mena is now a But, Tyga, 
Well, Erica Man is no angel angel either. Hi, guys. Um, I don't want to play devil's advocate, but we still wait on no, the receipts, brother. What receipt? The receipt? You have, have where have What's you going been? on with China? So, I'm just saying, like, Black China is still waiting for the receipt. What receipt? The receipt. Child support? She's just waiting on those receipts. What's going on? She's just waiting on those receipts. Hi, we have yet to see those receipts. And I know you don't have to prove nothing to Black China because I know, you know, you, you're with Kylie now. She's legal now. You got that's your receipt right there. That, that is your cut of the chat all day. But, but I, I'm feeling Black China because you, you, lately, you have been getting a lot of um, lawsuits. What? She not not Black China, not Black China. Um, Tyga has been oh. getting a lot of little lawsuits here and there. You know they've been trying to keep it under the radar, oh. but it just so happens, oh, you know, what? we would we would sweep those under the rug, except for the fact that, bruh, your baby mama is like, I still want to see them receipts, and so it makes it hard for us to. Um, show her the receipts. In the words of Whitney Houston, show me the receipts. Just, just show her on the blueprint. That's all. I mean. Uh, um, straight out of Compton. So basically, oh, straight out of Compton aired this weekend on the silver screen, and the crowd goes wow. It was an amazing, wasn't it? Amazing. Totally amazing. O'Shea Jr. or Noah. O'Shea Jackson Jr. or yes, like all day, team him all day. What? Are you crazy? If if you don't love you some O'Shea, if you O'Shea, don't. O'Shea, if y'all don't know who O'Shea Jr. is, that is Ice Cube Jr. He played Ice Cube, and he was dead on from the voice to the scenes that he was doing, the facial expressions, everything. So, Sunday, uh, opening weekend, was ended. Sunday. Okay. Hit 56 point one million dollars. Nice. Get your money, baby. Get your money, baby. But then Paul, it's Monday. And they've hit another four million dollars. Wow. And the day is not over yet. What time is it? It's six o'clock. The day is not over. People are still gonna be going to the movies. People are still going to be seeing this all week. They might as well say opening week, not weekend, because it's going on all yeah, week. Yeah, there is no end. So it puts them at a $60.2 million just bank hit, yes. bounce, victory, get your Bravo. money first. Yeah. Yeah, so $4.4 four million today is all they made, and that's just so far. Um, the week is not over yet. Then, in other news with Straight Outta Compton, there is, like, big talk about already it's Oscar-nominated. Already. It, 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 it's just It's just talk. It's Oscar-worthy. It, it, it's very Oscar-worthy. And if they worthy. don't get it, um, it's going to be It's going to be a like, riot. <laughs> it's going to be like Spike Lee when he came out with Malcolm X. Y'all, y'all gonna, y'all gonna be happy amongst the Republican, I'm gonna just say that, the Republican community, however, the African American community is not going to let that one ride. That one is going to be a mess. And if you want people to start boycotting the Oscars, then have at it. Black people really are starting to, you know, really not be into it, unless it's something of ours. We really don't really watch the Oscars anyway, because... Right. It's not um, really biased. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. biased. It's biased. And, you know, we're about our money. But, right. You know, and that's what, you know, I watched the interview with uh, NWA. Right. And uh, uh, actually, it was after, um, it was after, after the Grammys. Mm-hmm. And they was like, you know, a lady asked, well, you know, if you wouldn't have won, you know, how would your facial expression have been? And he was, you know, they was collectively like, who cares? Like, we wouldn't have had no expression because it's about the money. Like, the money talks. Right. You know? The money, and money does talk. Um, and seeing as how money talks, money's talking right now. P. Diddy is in these streets. Um, doing interviews. And not too much shade, just a little sprinkle be made. Um, basically, you know, just a toss on a little breeze at Meek Mill. Um, giving his props to Drake. Basically, did the, basically did the interviews, basically stating that I guess he did not want 
he didn't give Meek Mill the permission to use his voice or whatever to that nature. And so with that being said, he makes a little joke. Drake, don't do back to back on me. Um, kind of trying to say that. Yes. Kind of trying to say that Drake was killing the game on Meek Mill, which, you know, you're getting bodied by a singing nigga, and that's all you have to say. You're getting bodied by a singing nigga. You know, Twitter fingers turn to trigger, trigger fingers turn to Twitter fingers. Like, it, 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 is this a world tour or your girl's tour? But it's it's okay. It's okay. Shout you out know. to all the bad bitches, wiping niggas. It's okay because guess what? Those niggas got them bad bitches. So, you know... You could be mad all you want, but speaking of bad bitches, will she continue to be a bad bitch now that she may be or may not be pregnant? I heard about that, and I was like, what? And then I heard a rumor that it might be Drake's baby, and that's why Nikki hasn't been saying you tell? Girl, yes, I did, and that, that's why Nikki hasn't been saying anything in reference to the beef. Between Meek Mill and and if you know, I heard there were some text messages too. Nothing. So you know, I'm like, we oh. wait, we waiting on them receipts, Nikki. That's what we waiting on. We waiting on them receipts. Um, Omari on and April's baby is just the cutest thing. I just want to say that so really quick. Adorable. So adorable. If you haven't checked that, I'll go on his Instagram and and check out his baby trying to dance. It's the cutest thing ever. Um, ASAP Rocky. ASAP, is it ASAP Rocky or is it ASAP, it's ASAP Rocky and his crew. Uh-huh. They are, um, the fans are coming for them. Why? <laughs> the, the fans are coming. What are they doing? Your concert is getting too rough, rowdy, my nigga. Oh. It's getting too rough. It's getting it's too getting rowdy. Now. And, um, you might want to beef up security before you got to beef up them checks. So. What? Yeah. Um, the, the, the surf, I guess they did a surf during the concert, uh-huh. and it went wrong, and it got too rough, too rowdy. Some people got hurt, I guess, you know. That's a damn shame. You know, in lieu of watching NWA, uh, watching Straight Outta Compton, and, you know, seeing them be, being able to do a show, and nobody's tripping but the police. Right. We're screaming, fuck the police. You know, we scream in disrespectful nuances, and we on our best behavior. Ain't nobody fighting in the club, ain't right. nothing. But then you got this nigga ASAP Rocky, these new, you know, rappers, and it's like, that type of shit happens at, that type of shit happens at like a Drake concert, you know what I mean? And it's like... That shit happened at a Nicki Minaj concert actually the other day. Um, and I guess Nicki Minaj tweeted she got pinned or pinned to the floor or her knees got pinned or something. But, um, she was in, please let me get this right, I want to say she was in somewhere up north of California. Santa Cruz? Oakland? Somewhere over there. Okay. She was in o- Oakland somewhere, uh, she was somewhere up north in California, mm-hmm. NorCal. And bitches just, bitches just got rowdy and rough in the bay, I guess, and that's what, sometimes that's what happens, and so, um, you can check that fight out anywhere. You can just But you YouTube know what? It. Shout out to, shout out to No Cal, but. Can bitches just have a concert? Yeah, like, I, I mean, like, this is, what, and then y'all will swear to God that, you know, it's the other person that's changed, or they funny acting, you know what I mean? They bogus or whatever, they fake. Mm-hmm. But it's like, nigga, I, if this is how I make my money, and this is how I make my money, and you ending my life, or you putting hands and feet, and I'm getting bloody noses and eyes and care, and my my livelihood is being threatened, I'm not going to want to come to the no. Right. You know? Right. And I just feel like, you know, can y'all bitches just step y'all shit up? Like, y'all had Nicki Minaj in the building. If that ain't the fucking step up, I don't know what the fuck is. And I just feel like, bitch, so my, uh, Get your motherfucking life, no, co. Right. Um, no, speaking of people getting their lives, I'm going to need this Philadelphia Uber driver to get his life after going to jail for raping a woman. Um, Ab- I want to say his name right. Ab- Abdella, um, Abdella El, El, El- K. Some something. Show me where it's at. Yeah. It's Abdella. We just gonna call him by his first name because it's easier to pronounce. 
shame on you, brother. Um, shame on you. Um, yeah, charged with raping one of his Uber customers. Uber, when you do do drive Uber, okay, when you ride in Uber, you really do have to be careful because Uber does hire anybody. Anybody? Anybody. Oh, Uber shred. does. Is it Uber free? Uber is not free. So you pay to get raped. You she pay, she did pay to get raped. Oh, that's not funny. But I'm sure that that she'll be getting that money back. Uh, I'm that's very funny. sure she better be. But she will never get back her dignity. She will never get back them pop them nights of fear and. And she will never get back into another Uber. That's right. Um. So like you know, shame, dude, shame. Oh my God, I haven't tried Uber yet, but it that makes you nervous. Bad look. It yeah, makes you really nervous. Look. And it's just it it only sucks because you hire any you you're willing to hire That's any and everybody. Cool. Um, as long as you're I th I think it's something like as long as your car is like seven years, ten years within its range, mm -hmm. they'll hit you up and you don't have no real big criminal background. But see this is the thing. Just because I don't have a criminal background on paper doesn't mean I'm not crazy. Hello. I could have hidden it very well, i.e. Abdella or whoever he is. Caught. He's obviously has ha has hidden his mean streak very well, and um, he's just recently gotten caught and um, mm -hmm. messed up. And uh, you know, my prayers go out to you, and I hope that you are forgiven for whatever's going on. But shame well, on you. Well, we won't be um, recommending Ubers on Angie's list, I see. No, so. we will not. And Stevie Wonder. In other news, and Jasmine Sullivan, get your life. Thank you for the free concert. It was nice. No, um, they they did do a free concert. Um, they did a free pop up concert in D.C. Oh. And actually, it's Stevie Wonder's concert. Excuse me, I'm sorry. Stevie Wonder's concert. Jasmine Sullivan made her appearance. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, y'all did a bomb job. Like it was totally free. And if you were not there, get in the free music plus life. Get your life. Just, just get your life. Also, get your life and get a prima donna waist trainer. Like shout out to prima donna. She's doing Shout out to prima donna. But um, the other day, uh, I have to be honest, you guys. I just wanted to try it out. And I probably shouldn't be telling nobody this, but I bought a butt lift. <laughs> That shit look like a strap on without the penis. I, so there all my life, um, and it accentuates the waist and brings it in, and it just you know it it puts the little cheetahs, little cheaters on the thigh in the booty area, and so you know you get like that supple. You get the cheeks. The only thing is you can only wear pants. <laughs> But they sell them at your local swap meet. Get yours. I just wanted to try it out. I I haven't worn it out or anything. I think I swear it around the house with my man. Speaking of my man, perfect topic. Um, my man Matt Barnes. Like, what are you doing? Yeah. What What are you doing with your life? Um, what's going on with Matt Barnes? That is the TMZ Sports. Okay, caught up with Matt Barnes. What's up with you and Rihanna? Oh, nothing. We chilling. We dating. Who do I what? Giving us all the tea, all the juice, and giving us hope. My nigga Rihanna. Can I say why I love Rihanna? Why you love Rihanna? Bitch, you don't even let shit rest, nigga. <laughs> you don't even let shit rest. You didn't even give us a full 24 hours worth of research before she shut down the rumors. Um, via Instagram. Posted his picture via Instagram. Killed him with the hashtag. Dating bitch where? <laughs> you beautiful like diamond in the sky. And so I feel so bad. Like bitch, I don't feel bad. First of all, I don't feel bad for Matt Barnes because if we remember, if you guys don't know who Matt Barnes is, but you're in the reality TV world, we had to witness how he treated uh, Gloria. Gloria. And, you know, you just a nigga that just can't grow the fuck up. So you thought, nigga, you thought you had a Rihanna. You thought because you wanted to And can we just say what she killed him with with all the hashtags? She killed him with the bitch wear. The devil is a liar. Hashtag, she's not that into you. Hashtag, she's not into you at all. Hashtag, 
She's never met you, bro. <laughs> Hashtag. This actually hurt my feelings. Hashtag defamation of character. Yeah. Matt Barnes. You better get your fraudulent life. Now look at Matt Barnes. He been a fuck up. He been a fuck up. But it's fucked up because he might have had like one. I don't know. Maybe he just. I don't know. I don't know. But what you need to go do is get your life right with Gloria. Because she claimed you. And Gloria is like hot shit. Like she's hot. Yeah. Hot and, shit. And not to say Rihanna's not hot shit. Rihanna's but she's hot, hot shit. Man. We saw you snorting cocaine on TMZ. You know, you did get your ass beat. We're going to be over on the So, so the porn industry Maybe. wants Kylie Jenner. For what? To be in porn. She's 18. She's legal. Everybody's coming after her. Um, and that's including the porn industry. Please don't be like your sister. Get your life and just do Kylie. Like, you've been doing Kylie. Continue to do Kylie. And we love you for Kylie. Like, you don't have to be nobody else. Look at So, but they're, um, apparently they're offering her, like, major buku dollars to be in porn. Buku money? Like, buku. But can I just say this? Can I just say they're prepared to offer her $10 million? Like, that you that bitch that's more than your sister got. But you know, I'm not I'm not the one. And you probably just gonna post for a couple of pictures on Prince Playboy. She did a full on sex tape like ratchet baby. But can I say this though, with Kylie? Is she not inviting the illuminated situations into her life? She's acting more and more like a Kardashian Kardashian every day. Uh, you got the other one who named Kendall. Kendall. Uh, you know, she's very Jenner esque. She's very quick. She's very Jenner esque. She's very, you know, like down home growl good. What the fuck? What the fuck you trying to do? Wrap it up. Oh. Like. <laughs> Okay, so what out. I was trying to say is she's inviting the shit into in, into her life. She wants to be a Kardashian and she wants to be in that, that right. life. She wants to be just like her sister. So I see that in her future. Mm, not a good look. Just not a good look. I mean, but for today. I mean, that's I, all for today? That's your daily tea for that's right now. That's the daily tea. That is that for right now. now there will be to more to go. To all my company. What's the one? What's the song? Uh, so my team. Farewell. K E Y. B I T C H. Whoop whoop. It's been real, y'all.